It's a new cart of stuff coming out. All right, here we are. Doing our part. Doing our part. We got over here. I see an eagle. All right, Jordan has taken off. Should probably go look at clothes. We will have to catch up with her in a bit. Lots oh, of cute little, uh, little tea set kind of a thing going there. It's a Mr. Coffee. Oh, do you see them? Macho, macho mom. It's Saturday afternoon, the day after my party and the 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 first Saturday after a week-long conference and but you know what that doesn't stop us does not stop us from going to Goodwill Jordan's with me it might stop us a little bit barely barely with me I'm here I'm here she's there she'll perk up <laughs> so we're gonna get in there we're gonna see what we can find for resale I'm starting a whatnot oh yeah she is maybe we'll see <laughs> let me in. That's a definite maybe. Um, so we're gonna get we're gonna get in here, see what we can find. What are we waiting for? Coffee to kick in. Let's get shop done. All right, people, people, they're not gonna let us bring these things outside if we don't get them put away. So we must take these carts in. All right, here we are, doing our part, doing our part, bringing back the carts so that we don't get those ugly little poles put on them. This, hey, I think this one's my lucky cart. Anyway, this one right here. Warm. Hmm, I got some interesting pieces of furniture. Okay, none of these drawers, oh no. How does this open? Oh, oh, it's kind of a nice one. It doesn't have a ticket on it though. It means somebody's already claimed it. Oh, it's a new cart of stuff coming out. Ooh, I like this. Oh, it needs to be refinished, darn it. Darn it. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's another interesting piece over there. Hmm. That? Franco, that's Franco's piece of art. I don't know who Franco is. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's kind of cool, but it's not. It's not my flavor. But she just asked if it'll fit in my car, and I told her absolutely not. Oh, it's a two. Two carts are coming out. Oh, we got to get over. There. I'm getting over there because they got carts coming out. I'm serious. I know you're serious, and I'm ignoring you. This is kind of cool. This is all that repurposed wood. It's heavy though. I like it. I like it though. Pretty soon, all of my art will have a place to go. Cause the store's gonna be open. We're putting up slat wall on Monday. Cardinals lit canvas. Oh. It's one of those kind of things. Okay. One of those kind of things. Aww. How cute is that? Eight Ball by Michael Amon for Art's Sake Gallery, Hendon, London. Oh man, I kind of want to hang that in my pool room. How cute is that? Oh, that's actually. It is really cute. It's only $3.99. Okay, getting it. Let's see. Oh my gosh, what is this? That looks like a hobbyist lamp that's not quite done. So that's a no. Pretty tortoise shell. Jordan's finding frames. Big, big turtle down here. Ooh. That's a squish. That's a squish mallow for $2.99. We got over here. I see an eagle. Oh. Come out of here, eagle. 
think he's chalkware. He's got a little bit of damage on his toes. $7.99. It's kind of cool. I think those could be touched up pretty easy. It's pretty awesome. Let's get him. Let me find where we go. Where's our cart? Oh, there she is. I have to find her. Can I give you the bird? Wait, what is what's this? This is Mayflower. Oh, it's Vernon Kilns. It's a whole oh. set. There is a I know. Well, it's not quite a whole oh, set. They're down here. They're up there. Oh. Good look. The sugar's got a really bad damage on it. Oh, there's more pieces. Oh. Oh yeah. There's lots of pieces. Okay. We're not getting it. Oh. This is um cold claw china. Made in England. It's five ninety nine. It, I thought for a minute it was something else. It's got an Amari pattern to it, which is desirable. Ah, you know, I think I can do okay with this for six bucks. So I'm gonna grab this. Those are kind of cute. Mm. Strawberries. Oh, what are these? 99 cents. Yeah, they're pretty scratched up. All right, I think we're just going to get our one and go. So here is a little serving bowl. $8.99. Yeah. It just, it's not, China in general just doesn't sell for a whole bunch. Um, so I'm going to leave that. And this is treasure trap. I'm pretty sure. Yes, it is. I have some of these. I actually actually used them at my party last night. Um, it's missing its little chip cup, but it might be here somewhere because it could easily get separated. What I like is this one's blue. The ones I have have a peach rim. Um, and it's interesting. So this is when um, Treasure Craft was working with False Craft. So it's got a little bit more of that False Craft look to it. But let's see. How much are you? $7.99. You know, I'm going to put it in the cart and see if I can find the bowl, the the dip cup, the dip cup. That's it. These plates are really interesting. They look like they got little doilies inside. Very fine glass. Don't really want to ship those, but they are super interesting. What we got here? Malaysia. It's this pattern here. It's a Noritake. That's $8.99 for the sugar. And then they got a gravy boat and some bowls for $24.99. Again, China's a really, really hard sell. All right, Jordan has taken off. Should probably go look at clothes. We will have to catch up with her in a bit. That's the thing about filming, is you have to spend a little time and it gets boring. It does say Japan on it. Cute little yellow vase, but it's nothing much. Oh, there she is. <laughs> She'll be back when she needs to put something in the cart. That's what'll happen. JK Bavaria. Like this is probably an EAPG. It's got the look and the feel. It's just not a very notable pattern or anything. So it's got a little bit of purpling going too. Just starting to turn. And that can be good or that can be bad, depending which uh, collector you talk to. Some like the purpling and some hate it. That's an interesting piece. Oh, it's chipped. If that wasn't chipped, I, I would be tempted by that because it's got a really cool glaze on it. But unfortunately, that's, that's a lot of chipping. And this looks like Port Mirian, but it's a Studio Nova imitation of the botanicals. Oh, look what's in here. Holy moly. Tiffany found one the other night. And then look, 
This is like, but you gotta buy the whole, oh gosh, it's only $3.99 for the whole, I'm telling you, it's worth spending $3.99 just to get that piece to use on a, a better set. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. He's kind of cute. WCL. Kind of cute, kind of cute. I see these a lot. I don't tend to pick them up. Whoop. This card has a mind of its own. It just wants to roll away. That's different. It's made in Mexico. I'm not sure what that's for. What is that for? I don't know. I don't know. We're going to leave it. Ooh, you found polar bear. Are they grizzly or polar bears? I think they're the California state bear. Are, oh, so they're grizzly bears. Those are kind of cool. Who makes them? Well, let's find out who makes them. Coil. C-O-Y-L-E is what that says. Those are nice. For two bucks each? Yeah. Put those in the cart. Oh. Oh, you've got to learn the art of, of cartage here. Stick that there. Stick him here. You got spot right there. There you go. I would lay him down. I'd lay him down. There we go. All safe. A coasters. They're coasters in a billiard ball. I'm. 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 Wait. Well, then, if I'm getting them, I actually. I'm. I'm, I'm doing this thing called video. You might. You might have heard about it. All right. Those are cool. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A set of eight for four ninety nine. Yes, we will take those. How you brewing? What's on the other side? Oh, it's the same. That's really, really cute. How you brewing? Oh, it's a cute little, uh, little tea set kind of a thing going there. It's a Mr. Coffee. Mr. Does Mr. Coffee still make stuff like this? Maybe it's vintage. Maybe it is. It could be. Oh, bougie. Bougie would be all digging this right here. That's Bougie's favorite food. Pistachios. What's that? It's a flower vase. What you doing with the flower vase? Just putting it in the cart. Oh. See, I like the I like to see what she does with the stuff and then she decorates and makes everything really, really cute and are these marble? These are marble. <gasps> oh, they're heavy. They're heavy marble. Oh, it's missing its bottom. I wonder how hard that is to replace. Er, I just don't, I don't have time to deal with it. So it will stay. And wait for somebody who has more time to deal with finding a, a bottom for that. And we'll look at this sugar bow. This is interesting. I just, I like the blue and the green glaze. It's an interesting piece. Oh, it's coal pottery, JB Coal Pottery. It's on the inside. That's cool. And it's $4.99. We shall get it. What are you doing? Uh, nothing. Don't worry about what it. Do, what is all that? We're going to be carving pumpkins. What are you going to so, We are? Yeah. Who? When? Where? You, you and us. We need kids. five? Well, we need five pumpkin carving things? A special carving knife. Yeah, you just don't worry about it. Just don't oh worry my about goodness. It. Don't worry about it. <sighs> Look at this little set. Do you see this? What is it? It's a little tequila oh, set. Oh, decanter. That's yes. a cute little gift set. Oh. It is a cute little Riviera Maya. Must have been from like a resort. $7.99. It's cute. I like these. Oh, oh. They're taped on. They tape them. Let's see who they're made by anybody. They look very, oh, they're Kirkland's. Okay. Very, very contemporary. What's a Kirkland? It's a store. It's like a liquidation store kind of thing. It's not Costco? No. 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 All right. Onward. Oh, let's see. What's on the shelf? Glassware. Hmm. Oh, I like the little uh, pink hibiscus glasses. These are really nice quality. They don't say Libby, but I would guess they're probably Libby. They just have a very pleasant look to them. Do I like this? 
it's um it's like newer carnival glass iridescent i think that indiana makes that one i know but do i like it i don't know if don't you know how do i know if you like it I guess if I could get in your brain, I, I would be much further ahead in life. <laughs> Look at this little guy. It's a giraffe glass. A giraffe martini glass. At least signed on the bottom by somebody. Stand by. Yeah, yeah, Jordan. Look, she can't make it out either. But hey, I did. I made out the letters. I did realize it's got a turtle for a for a logo. I think was single giraffe uh, martini glass would be a good thing to sell. I'm going to justify it and I'm going to buy it for $1.99. You scoured for another giraffe or another animal that goes with a giraffe? What are these? Uh, oh, I got it in my hand and I still don't know what it is. This is dash. I don't know. Like a car part almost. <laughs> no more giraffes. She said she looked. She looked because she would have bought them if there was two. So lucky me because there's only one. I get it. All right. Let's see. See anything? Nope. Got a ram's glass. Wow, look at that picture right there. Substantial. Oh, is that Hercules from, yeah, it's from Disney. That's an odd mug though. I wouldn't want to drink out of that mug. It'd be a little awkward. Oh, now what did you find? You know, I think we finally figured out how much a mega pint is. Oh, because it's a mega flask. A flask full of Christmas spirits. I like it. Uh, any mugs today? What are you? The Crimes of Grindelwald. Okay, I don't know who that is. I should probably look it up, but I'm a little tired and I don't feel like it. And it's okay, because I don't have to get every single thing that's worth something. I like leaving stuff behind for other people. Dream. Oh, that's that one with the chip. I think I looked at that the last time I was here. These are plastic, but those are fun. There's a whole set. <laughs> Nothing exciting in the plastics. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Why is, is that glass? It is glass, it's over in the plastic. She looked at that. But it wasn't anything really worth picking up. All right, we're over in the metals. Looking for something fantastic. Little fake plants. We always love our little fake plants, but we've got plenty for now. This is a cute little set of drawers. They are tin. Let's see. Almost looks like homemade. Look at a little Paris print on the back. Hmm. Hmm. What's under here? Ooh, a first aid kit. We kind of need this. We kind of need this for the store. It's $12.99. Um, I think I will grab that for the new store. 
What do you got? I see an inflatable. Oh, look at him. You know he's 35 bucks. That's their new merchandise. Yeah. Make your decisions wisely. Oh, look, look, it's going in the cart. It's going in the cart. And what's that? That's it. See, she, see, this is interesting, guys. So she looks at it as just like a decorative. She doesn't even care what the bottom says. She doesn't even bother to look, but I, I want to know. I but I want to know. Okay. It's all good. Yeah. I'm not doing it right. Hey. This is kind of a, I don't know why I'm drawn to this little organizer thing. A thing to hold more of your things? A thing to hold more of my things, yes. Maybe black lights on my desk. It's only $3.99. Look at it spinny. You know what? Either Rachel or I can use that. What have you got now? Oh, it's a little topiary ducky. He's got a little, he's got a little damage. Okay, we will. <laughs> Those are really cute. Those are really, really cute. Alright, what is that? Holy moly, look at that big old glass monstrosity. $9.99. It's just kind of cheap Chinese glass. It's kind of cool though. I kind of like it. She decided not the to get these. And I just really, really don't need them. Yeah, I'm the welcome sign. It's a resin log. A resin log. Again, is there a bird? that would use this. I don't know. I think it's it's a prayer box, so it's not even for a bird, it's for prayers. Still looking for more bird houses. They want more bird houses. They need their little winter hideaways. I want to I want my yard to be their little abode. He looks like paper mache. He's cool for $3.99 grabbing him and then there was a dinosaur actually I think this had another piece it was a um, triceratops but it's now just a tricera it's missing its tops <laughs> there's birdhouses right there it's cute Cow. Little envelopes. Follow your dreams. They know the way. There you go. Little wishing well. Simon. Feeling beachy. <laughs> Cute. Oh, look at that little handcrafted piece. It's double sided. This little piggy. Baths. Mm, it's really lightweight. It would, it would be good for whatnot, so I think I'll get it. This is a really, really pretty piece of cobalt blue. It's like it's bigger than a bun vase, but it's nicely done. It's got the rounded rolled edge and it's got the clear foot for $5.99. We're going to grab that. See if there's any other pretty color goodies in here. I see things that I've seen at Ikea. Oh, that's nice. We're going to look at that in a second after I look at this little bear. Okay, he's not... He's not very high quality. This is a, oh, that's heavy. Interesting piece. It does look like it's got some age on it, but super heavy. And I have to think the cost to ship that, when somebody sees that in a listing, it's going to take away from the value what they would pay for the item itself. And since we don't make money on the shipping, that kind of makes it not worth picking up and doing all the work to list it. But this one has my eye. With all these little applied fall pieces on both sides too. 
It came from Big Lots. Can you believe that? It's a Big Lots piece. It totally fooled me. Totally fooled me. I don't, I don't think that's the right thing for it. But I'll just put it back the way they had it, just because that's how they had it. All right. Now I have lost Jordan. Now Jordan is over in the clothing. I like I like the fake plants that are, oh, I like that it's a, a ha, oh, it's a hanging. Okay, I like that even better now. Faux hanging plant, huh. From 2020 from Target, but I like it. I like, I, just because it came from Target doesn't mean it was cheap either. Target stuff is going up in price by the day. I, I kinda, I'm kinda digging that one. I am kind of digging that one for five bucks. I think I'm gonna get it. See what else we got here. Nothing else, I don't think. Nope. Some fake, fake flowers, but nothing exciting. I did want to come over and look at these daisies, though. I do kind of like the daisies. They're they're a dollar ninety nine. That's a good price. I think I will get the daisies. All right, we are into just the tchotchkes. Ooh, those are Goddard. Michael Goddard art. I don't know what kind of dishes these are meant to be, but $2.99 each? I am going to grab those. Actually, they go like that. Let's see what this little girl is here. Designed by Collections Etc. Okay, that's not super exciting. Pine cones and some dolls. There's another one. Let's put her over here with her friend. There we go. These caught my eye. Kind of heavy. They are, what does that say? Studio 1994. Something Studio. They're kind of cool, but they are $6 each. I may look those up just because they're such a fun shape and they are quality and they are vintage. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in the cart and decide if I'm going to keep those. Oh, what is up here? Little heavy glass Valentine's candle holders. There's a decanter of a stagecoach, uh, not stagecoach, covered wagon. A liquor bottle 185 created by Paul Lux. Huh. They're asking 10 on that. Oh, that's plastic. I thought it was not plastic. <laughs> Anything but plastic. Is this the Zook Schoolhouse, the Amish Schoolhouse, Amish Heritage Collection? It's kind of cute. The little seesaw. I'm looking for any damage. That's just a little piece of styrofoam up there from when it came out of its box. You know what? For $3.99, I think I'm going to grab that. Oh, do you see them? Goodness, goodness, goodness. There are cactus and Christmas trees and chili peppers and dice all for $3.99. Uh, absolutely yes. Not sure. El Beso GTO. I don't know what that is. Oh, collector plates. Surely there must, must be something that could be done with collector plates. There just must be something that could be done with them. Such a shame. There's so many of them out there and I'm sure so many are hitting the the landfill. That's a little Peter Rabbit tin for 99 cents. Another great whatnot item. I'm gonna grab it. Cute little, cute little bunnies. Oh, that's got some weight to it. Goodness. Little piece of pottery. 
I'm getting back here to these berry baskets. Oh, they were only $3. Some of them can go for quite a bit of money. So I do watch for the ones that are actually a brand name. Lots of stuff comes from like the, the dollar stores and ends up here. I am seeing a piece here. It's acrylic though. It's interesting. I'm not sure what that's all about. What its purpose is. We're gonna we're gonna leave it. Try to put it back where I found it here. Let's see what these are. Little bunnies. We'll leave those too. Hmm. These are older candle holders too. They are a little beat up though, unfortunately. But gosh, I really like them. I may do just a quick look up on these to see if they're anything I shouldn't be leaving behind. So they are Scandinavian. They're mid-century Mastad, M-A-S-T-A-D. There's several of them listed and there's no sold. So that's the reason I'm gonna leave them. That along with the condition. If the condition was good, I'd have no problem buying and holding on to them and you know, as a long tail item. But I think because there are so many listed and the condition's not great on these ones, I am gonna leave them. This looks like an anthropology piece right here. What a cool candle holder. I'm looking for any damage. I'm not seeing any damage. I don't know if it's anthropology. I'm just, it just reminds me of those anthropology vases, you know, with the big flowers like that on it. It's just neat. It's just, I like it. It's calling me. It's calling me for $2.99. It's calling me. Let's see what this bunny here is. Oh, he's some kind of a mold. Heartstone, USA 1993. Interesting. Interesting. This looks very mid-century. It is California, USA Whittier Potteries. How much are you? $2.99? All right. Sometimes I miss damage. So I was looking a little closer because it's white and hard to see, but look at the whole corner is shaved off there. Darn it. I mean, that handle is so cool. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna leave it. It pains me though. It pains me. Is this? No, I thought it was Mary Englebright for a minute. It's Jan Shade Lynch, 1995. It's cute. I'll leave that one for somebody else as well. All right, we're in the bathroom stuff. Cute little soap dispenser. Shaving cream. Don't need shaving cream. Tape dispenser. What kind of tape dispenser do we have here? Looks like a return. It's the pink one. We don't really need it. Why do I look at things I don't really need? Why do I get drawn to that? You guys, have, does that happen to you too? Like just because something's cool and like you gotta tell yourself, no, no, I really don't need this. And then put it away. Just put it away. Look at this magic kit. It's pretty cool. And then a big laundry basket. It's got some staining on it though. See anything too exciting here? And it's getting a little crowded in this store. I don't usually shop on a Saturday afternoon, but I was a little occupied all week long, so this is my first chance to get back out. So I'm walking over to find Jordan, and I'm stopped in my tracks by these beautiful antique chairs. 
They're $75 each. Those are so cool. All right, let's peruse the pillows. That is so orange. Oh my goodness. Ah, the little, little pill pillow, I think they call these. Would fit good in a mid-century decor. Because that orange is like a thing. Nice blue. Mm -hmm. Is that a hockey puck? Yeah. It's a hockey puck pillow. Oh. Cute plaid. All right. I don't see anything else in the pillows that we need today. Ah, I see some tapestries here. How much are these? They're not like super big sellers, but they do sell. They are vintage. They're only $2.99 each. That's what's crazy. And there are four of them. Look at this. Last Supper. A cheetah or a leopard. Looks like he's drinking. Oops. Uh, we've got another Jesus and we've got like a Mediterranean scene. I think I am going to put those in the cart. Let's see what we got here in the placemats. Those are cute. Great 4th of July placemats. LLL That's what it says on them. $2.99. I think that's for the set. Huh. And there's... Nope, those are different. So there's two sets of four. So there would be eight of them. You know what? I think I am going to pick those up. The skulls caught my eye. But they are not anything super fab. These are pillow... Um, covers. Who makes you? Oh, Exhilaration. They are a Target brand. Cute little quilted flower pillow shams, but those don't sell very well. It's time to start thinking about blankets. Blankets are going to be selling here now. It's getting colder. Cute little granny square. Children's blanket. Yeah, that's a really cute little granny square and it's got a good feel to it too. It's $3.99. It's got some pulls. It's definitely been used and washed so I'm gonna leave it. But these are fun. Add a kid from the Venetian. I know they sell these for like $20 at the Venetian. I've priced them before. Oh yeah $14.95. $14.95. And they're $1.99 here. Hmm. Hmm. Nah. We'll leave those for somebody else. Let's see if we've got anything up in the toys. It reminded me of a jelly cat. I have still got a whole bag of jelly cat animals that I've got to deal with soon. I've just, one thing after another has been distracting me from getting back to the things that were on my plate before. All right. Oh, oh, that's, um, it's a Coles Cares. Gosh, they, they get me with all of the vintage characters, but they're not, these are not, they don't sell for much, darn it. But I'm trying to think of the name of him. Somebody help me, somebody help me. What is this? The Punching Nun? What in the world? <laughs> Okay, that's just kind of ridiculous. Kind of ridiculous. Oh, it's a little coconut purse. $1.99. Last time I passed one of these up and I researched it and thought, oh, you really should have picked that up. They sell pretty good. So I think this time I will get it for $1.99. Look at these shoes. I think they're hand painted. Pretty sure these are hand painted. Size sevens. 
They're like new though. It doesn't look like they've gotten much wear at all. Those are super adorable. For $3.99, I'm grabbing them. I didn't have to go find her. She found me. What you got? What you got? Oh, we got some clothes. Oh, you got some cute. You always find cute clothes. So, I'm looking for stuff to be like stylized, what not sale. So, like a business attire or a car. Yeah. Cord, so, themed. So. Themed is very important. Yeah. Hey, look at these. Hold on. Are you going to do a try on for us? I don't know if all these will fit, but I'll, I'll try to do a try on. But look at these pants. We can't promise anything, but maybe. <gasps> Tommy Bahamas? 100%. What? Oh my gosh, they're only three dollars. She really knows how to shop clothes. Size, what size are they? Twelve. Oh. No, these are six. Still too big for me. They're not too big for me. Oh. 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 <laughs> looky, 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 looky. I found more. These are size six. But they are purple, and again, it's just really, really good condition. So we're gonna grab those too. All right, we're gonna peruse the purses a little bit here. See if anything stands out. A little black patent leather there. This is kind of cute. Oh, very, very bad feel to the leather. I think I looked at this one before. It's trying to look trying to look like a dooney um and then and then teeny and then teeny moda italiana maybe i should look that one up oh it's 20 bucks well they apparently think it's something special so i'm gonna look it up so this brand is good in the larger purses this size sells for about 20 to 25 so we can't pay 20 and sell it for 20. What you got? What you looking oh, at? I like it. What you seeing? It's very thin. Yeah. I kind of go by the feel first, like, because I know the feel of good leather. So that's like my first, like if I feel it and it's just like cheap leather, I'm just blah. No, we don't look for any further. I like the color of this one. Mia K collection. Blue, I'm drawn to the blue. Hmm. Oh, and then there's boots. Oh yeah, it's boot season. Boot season's on. It's on and on. That's a nice leather. See that? I'm like, okay, who makes you? Because you're a really soft, supple, nice leather. But you think we can, it's probably in the main one, the one that I can't get open until Jordan comes over here and gives me an extra set of hands here. <laughs> oh, there we go. Just like that. Is that a good name? I don't know. Madison West? It's a name. I wouldn't name my daughter it, but whatever. Maybe we should look it up. We're going to look it up. So again, this is about a $20 backpack, so we will leave that one as well. All right, these are really cute. JJ Swa. JJ Swa. Mucklux. Mucklux is a good brand, but those are pretty well worn. Hmm. Hmm, I love boots. Apparently Jordan loves boots too. You I love boots? You have an idea? Halloween oh. costume. Halloween costume. Cause she can actually walk in boots like that. Apparently. Oh, you, you wanna see you wanna see her fingernails? She's wearing gummy bears on on her fingers. And she's got gummy bears in her ears. Oh. I don't know what size she's in. I found a nice Mercedes wallet in here last time, which I already sold Microsoft. So I always take a peek in here at the little wallets and coin purses and such. Uh, just to see what might be lurking. I don't 
see anything exciting today. Wow, that's that's well used right there. What's this one? Nanette Le Oh, Nanette Lepore. Why do I feel like that's a good name? I feel like that's a good name. And I am going to be doing another whatnot purse sale in the very near future. So I'm gonna pick up the Nanette Lepore. How much is it? $2.99. We'll take it. All right, Jordan wants to go. So we are gonna go check out. Stay tuned for the recap. I'll tell you everything I bought, what I paid, and how much it's worth on eBay. That's coming up right now. Ended up with two cards full. Two cards. Oh, I added something at the end. I can't get it. Okay, we'll get it in a minute. It's stuck. Anticipation. They'll have to wait to see it. <laughs> While Jordan was checking out, I looked up on a top shelf and I found like the most adorable little planter. It's a little. It's a little stagecoach. So cute for $9.99. Now, <laughs> it was just a frame. It was just a frame. Okay, that box is a little bit heavy. Got all the breakables in there. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. I do you need help since I don't I'm not wearing gummy bears on my fingers, so I could probably do that one. Okay, I can help with that one. Okay. <laughs> a little mini Cooper almost got squished. <laughs> So what happens when you pull out in front of trucks? Oh, 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 got it. Oh, I got 
Uh oh, cart, cart, carts are wanting to take off. They have a mind of their own. I can still smell the exhaust from that Mini Cooper. Yeah, switch. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> We're losing them. We're losing them. Okay. We're on okay. a hill. Macho, macho mom. You got him, you got him with a car. Oh, I can't. Get it in there. You can do it. Don't, I don't like that sound. Oh, oh, you gotta get the, the, I can't. I'm, oh, you can't get it at all? Okay. I'm, get, I'm holding all the things. Strategically put the wheels down there. Well, you strategically locked it in. All right, now let's, let's go put these cards away because I'm cold. Yeah. <laughs> they don't, they don't steer so good this way. Are you sure? Do you want me to help? Okay, bye. Wait, wait. That one you don't. You, oh my God. Yep. Okay. Yep. What are you? The cart return now? Yep. Don't pull it this way. We want to be allowed to be taking the carts to the. Okay. What about that one over there? No, I'll take me that one. <laughs> my, <laughs> my generosity only goes so far. Okay. All right. Okay. Are you sure? Are you sure? <laughs> watch for cards. Watch for cards. Look left. Look right. You didn't look both ways. I can't turn. <laughs> I can't, I can't turn. Oh boy. Fantastic. Good job. Good job. Watch them start rolling backwards now. Let's go to the car. Let's go. I feel like taking my life in my hands. I'm letting her drive. <laughs> Necessary things after shopping. All right. We're calling it a day. That's it. We got good stuff. You go be profitable. And... Moisturize. Make it fun. Someday she'll get with the program. Not today. See you on the next one.